Hey everyone, UWUltra here, welcome back to the channel, bringing you a new video of Warhammer 40k Darktide, playing this on my PC and on my Odyssey G9. Now looking at the settings, I am playing this at a resolution of 5120 by 1440 with all in-game settings set to max and DLSS set to performance. Uh, worth noting, uh, among the max settings, this does include high on ray trace global illumination and reflections. Now before going any further, a few things to note. First, if you enjoy this video and the content on my channel, please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe. Every little bit helps us to continue our growth and our travel, our road to a thousand subscribers. And just overall, I really do appreciate your support as we continue to grow the channel and expand the content. Also, down in the description, you can find a few different pieces of information, which include a link tree where you could donate to and support the channel directly. A 5% discount code off coffee and tea orders. And finally, a full detailed list of my Odyssey G9 picture settings and NVIDIA control panel settings. Now overall, again, continuing to just really enjoy this game. This is a phenomenal, just overall experience of a game. Um, if you really like that Horde uh, kind of shooter, something similar to Left 4 Dead, although I, I, I think this is significantly better than Left 4 Dead. Um, I mean, this is just a, a phenomenal game to play. I mean, the world and the environments, everything that have been created here just are stellar. Now, uh, overall performance is definitely more stable than it was at launch. Now, again, when trying to use ray tracing and everything, even with DLS perform DLSS performance, um, you know, when action gets crazy on screen, this this game still chugs along down to you know mid 40s or 50s on the FPS side. So, um, still an incredibly demanding game, just given the the ray tracing in here. Which, um, again, when you know when you when you see it, I mean, it it, it is a I think one of the best implementations of ray tracing. So, um, yeah, it's very beautiful game, but certainly very demanding. Now, in terms of you know the screen itself, the game supports 32 by 9 out the box, so there's no need for you know outside programs or anything. And the game looks fantastic. You know, it has a field of view slider; you can adjust that to your liking. But um, overall, the game scales to it and looks wonderful on on this display. So. With all that though, I'll go ahead and keep the commentary short here and just let you enjoy the rest of the video. Um, let me know down in the comments if you have any questions at all, whether it's about the game or the screen itself or any of my settings. I really do appreciate you guys for your continued support. Don't forget to hit that like button and I'll talk to you later. I confess, I have a bad feeling about this mission. Plenty of trouble behind it all. Maybe we should just call it a
A med station? Hound is coming! Ammunition! Death unto his servant!
some peace. the means of death unto his servant.
Fight in his holy name! 